Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. If you're returning, welcome. If you're new, my name is Chris, or That Hiking Guy, and today I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about Kickstarter. About eight months ago, I backed a company that were making backpacking, camping, and hiking sporks for the backpacking meals that we all know and love, and I was really intrigued by their design and the ability to get every last morsel out of the bag. And coincidentally enough, it's called the Morsel Spork. So I'm gonna show you some of the features of this spork and I'm gonna compare it to my titanium that I usually use. And you can make a decision whether you like these or you can make a decision whether you think they're a waste of money. Now, stay tuned to the end of the video because I'm gonna give you a chance to win one. I actually bought three of them with, with one, I had one in mind to give away. So I'm gonna give away one at the end of this video and so stay tuned to the end for more details on that. So let's get into the spork and some of the features. Okay, so here is the spork. As you can see right here, it's kind of a different design and it's basically made for right-handed people as all things are. I'm left-handed, thank goodness. But it has a cool set of features that I wanna show you. First and foremost, you can see the, the curve of the spoon and what you can also see is around the edge of the spoon it has a rubberized has a rubberized surface where you can actually get down at the bottom of and get that last morsel of of your backpacking meal i like that fact and also this is i measured this earlier and this is 10 and a half inches long um, so it actually will uh, it will accommodate the the bigger sacks of or bags of backpacking meal. And on the other side is the spork, and the spork has, or the fork I should say, it has this kind of a pseudo serrated edge. Now this is pretty hard plastic, it's BPA free, it has a good, it's very good strength to it. It weighs about an ounce, so all you ultralight backpackers might wanna take that into consideration. But it also has a place that you can either hang it or I guess you can drain your liquid from the spoon out the other end. I don't know why you would need that. But yeah, it's pretty pretty cool little design. I, I, I like this design a lot. Now if you compare it to, this is what I usually use. This is the uh, titanium set that I have. And these are about a half ounce each. But if you compare the length, side by side you can see that you you can get all the way down to in fact it's actually more like that it's about an inch and a half probably two inches longer you can get down to the bottom of the bag more so with this than you can with this so if you're okay with the added weight um, then this is this is the morsel spork for you so <clears throat> as I said earlier it's BPA free what I'm gonna do now is I've got one I don't, I don't use backpacking meals anymore. I do dehydrated food or I, or I just bring my own different kind of camping food. But I'm gonna make my very last one that I have and I'm going to show you, now this is a single serve bag, but I'm gonna show you how you can scrape everything out of the bottom. So hopefully this demonstration goes as planned. So let's get started. Okay, so while that is waiting to finish up, I just wanna tell you now how you can win one of these. Now, the red one that you've seen is not the one you'll be winning. I actually, like I said, I bought more than one just so I could give one away. This is the color of the one that is up for the giveaway. And so, like you said, like you see, I've not used it at all. The red one is the one I'm keeping. So, how do you win this? Basically, what I need you to do is put a comment below on this video with the um, hashtag, hashtag that hiking guy, as a comment or as part of your comment. And so hashtag that hiking guy, all one word. It doesn't have to be capitalized or anything like that. It can be all lowercase. So I will just do a random comment generator based on how many people put that. And we'll do that in about a week. But I just wanted to give away one of these so I could get another opinion on this from somebody who actually does this. So 
If you want to win this, just put hashtag that hiking guy in the comments below. And in about a week, I will uh, pick the winner by random comment generator. So let's get back to seeing how this does. And I'll show you as I'm scraping the bag out um, how effective the scraper part of this is. Okay, so I've eaten a little bit of this and I'm trying to get a close-up here of the bag. Hopefully you can see that. As you can see, even though I'm left-handed, I can still get a good scrape on the bottom of that bag and get, and I think it's the rubberized part of it that really helps. But I can get just about every single piece of it. Hopefully you can see that. Let's see if I can turn the camera here. Um, so, yeah, so this is one of the appeals to me for this particular spork. Also, um, these are easy to clean up. I'm not saying titanium isn't, but these are really easy to clean up and they're really rigid. So, I, yeah, I like it. This is... This is my go-to, my new go-to. And I hope whoever wins this uh, makes a video about it because I'd like a second opinion. Okay, so that's all I have for you today. I hope you've enjoyed this and I hope you got some value out of this. Like I said, that hiking guy, hashtag that hiking guy is a comment to enter the giveaway. And I'm looking for a second opinion here on this. Makes me wonder if, uh, you know, I mean, I know not all Kickstarter products are great, but I want to see how somebody who actually does this um, goes backpacking and uses it uh, thinks about this. So always remember to get out there and explore and we'll see you later. One love.